Hey, what's up guys? I'm Anoush from AndroidRoots.com. Today we're going to go ahead and take a look at CyanogenMod theme showcase app for your CyanogenMod ROM based phone. So yes, you actually have to be on CyanogenMod M7 or above for this actual app um, to actually work on your device. So no, if you own a Galaxy S5 with TouchWiz like I do for this phone, it's not going to work. You have to be on CyanogenMod M7 or above for this uh, showcase app to actually work. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look at this. So it's actually a very, very clean app. There isn't a lot of themes. There's a few here and there. Um, majority do uh, do cost money, but there are a couple free ones which I'll go ahead and show you uh, for more of the most part. Um, but here it is. Here's the theme themes showcase, and you have a couple options. You just have basic themes. You have styles, icons, wallpapers, lock, uh, wallpapers, fonts, boot animation, and also sound packs. Um, so you can actually go ahead and uh, sort through each of these or you can go ahead and choose the main one. Um, so let's say for example I just want themes. Um, you can see which ones do actually show up. So you have all these. Um, but if I actually go ahead and tap on icons as well, basically the same ones do show up. Um, just about all the same ones do show up as well. Um, so some of these themes do offer all of these options. The, some of these themes offer some of these options. Um, so that's how it works. So let's go ahead and choose one of these. So I, I already went ahead and installed this free one great freedom i'm gonna go ahead and tap on it um it says installed and you can go ahead and after you install it, you can go ahead and just tap in view and theme chooser and within here this is where you can go ahead and pick and choose which ones which one you want to uh, have applied from great freedom so let's say i only want wallpapers applied from great freedom i can go ahead and easy apply it um it says update it's done now if I go ahead and look on my lock screen or my home screen, there you go. It has that new wallpaper, super quick, super, super easy. Um, I love this, very easy. I just hope they uh, more theme developers go ahead and make this compatible since it's really intuitive, very, very easy. Um, let's say I want to do icons now. Well, there aren't a lot of icons for this theme, but I can still go ahead and update it. It says applying, it's done. And now the icons are a little bit different. Um, the main one that changed is this one, Gmail. Um, let's go ahead and choose uh, another one just so, for the sake of it. Let's do lock wallpapers. Um, okay, so if I go ahead and tap on it, I tap on update and it goes away. That means there is no lock wallpapers available for it. Um, so that's how you guys do that. Um, also, you can go ahead and do style. I don't think there's anything available for that either. Yes, yeah, so there's no style available either. Okay, so let's go ahead and now go back and take a look at another theme. Um, let's say I want to go to that red one. Um, I know I installed the red one just earlier. There we go. Uh, Crimson Cobalt right here. Um, let's go ahead and tap on View and Theme Chooser. Um, this is a different section of the actual app. It opens up into a different app if you guys are wondering. Um, and for some reason, this one actually knows which ones um, are available, unlike the other one. Um, so it's whited out for the ones that aren't available. So uh, there's probably a few bugs here and there to be fixed out since this is a very brand new app. Only a few days old. I think it's only two or three days old. Or two, uh, three days old actually. Three or four days old um, from what I'm seeing on my computer. Um, so we can go ahead and tap on styles and wallpapers. We'll go ahead and tap on apply. And all red, you can see on the bottom, you have those red navigation bars, which is very cool. If I go ahead and move up, as you can see now, it's a red halo effect. Once I go ahead and reach the limits, um, is a scroll bar there. There's no scroll bar. I can't really see that. And also the wallpaper is changed up. Um, icons up here are the uh, options right here. Wi-Fi, sound, battery, SIM card, time. All that good stuff is all red. Okay, yeah, that's insane. So it works really well. It goes really deep into your phone. Um, uh, all the icons are changed with a nice red. Let's see if settings, yep, settings changed as well. So as you can see, it does a really good job of really changing up how your phone looks like really, really quickly. And you can go and pick and choose what you want to be themed up and what you don't want to be themed up. Um, so that's really nice. So I'm a really big fan of that. And you do have a couple of paid ones. So Flux, you have, um, it's 175 if you want to go and pick it up from the Play Store. And I'll show you how it looks if you want to go and purchase it. Um, same way with free apps, you just go and tap on purchase. It opens up in the Play Store. For some reason, this one's not found. Let's go and try another one. Um, we can go and try out JB Extreme, Jelly Bean Extreme. Tap on purchase and it should, there we go. Um, so now it's Jelly Bean Extreme. Um, you tap on install um, and it'll go ahead and um, install it. Then you open up the app again and you can apply it. Um, so it's so very, very straightforward on how I actually apply it, what to pick and choose. Um, that's pretty much guys for this video. That is a Cyanogemod theme showcase app for Cyanogemod M7 based devices or above. Um, I'm actually running on uh, 
Cyanogemon M7 on my Nexus 5 right here. So that's how I can make it to work. Um, but yeah, guys, if you guys did enjoy this app review for the Cyanogemon Theme Showcase app, be sure to like and subscribe in the bottom left hand corner right there. Do appreciate all the support you guys do give me. And go, don't forget to follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and Google+. Plus. Links are down below for that too. And link to the app is located down below in the video description as well. Until next time, I'll catch you later. Peace.